How's it? Indian Cowboy to Oxports.com. Connection on Monday, April the 18th as we get this video to you. Nice free pick winner yesterday. Uh, hopefully we will have another free pick winner for you today. I believe we gave you the Phoenix Suns and New Orleans uh, in the NBA. And I believe that was a winner for you. Hopefully we'll get you another free pick winner today. We hit by about 15 points and I believe we also won our YouTube premium winner too. If I'm not mistaken, uh, we gave you the Reds and the Dodgers over which was a winner, and also the Bucks and the Bulls under as well. So back-to-back -back free pick winners. We're also on a 10-5 uh, free pick one, 77-45 for over uh, six months now. No, sorry, four months. So 64% of free picks for four months, which is very good. Hello, I'm Indian Cowboy, and this is Doc Sports. Indian Cowboy has been around for 18 years and three months now, and Doc Sports has been around, well, almost four months now, and uh, Doc Sports has been around for 52 years, been around a long time. How this works is our best selections are on at DocSports.com under Indian Cowboy. A lot of the great statisticians and handicappers there, too. I, uh, I have a doctorate and a master's in biostatistics, and, um, you know, how it works, our best selections are over there. You can get free $60 worth of premium picks on the pinned to the comment section on the link below. You can also join our YouTube premium uh, uh, channel as well, where we give you two extra thoughts every single day, which people enjoy. And we do a live show once a week as well. We'll try to do uh, maybe a live show tonight, uh, late tonight around 11 Eastern or uh, at night. So if you want to join us, you can. It's recorded. Uh, it'll probably give you a little heads up on what our selections are like for the next day. A sneak peek. And we also do a live show usually Thursday at 9 p.m. Eastern. So grab that as well. Uh, what else do we need to tell you? Our, uh, be sure to check our Twitter for our latest consensus polls, uh, for even more content, our latest trends on late night ball games, trivia questions, poems, limericks, and our hot takes on sports. And uh, the link to YouTube Premium is linked in the comment section as well. What do I need to tell you? Well, I mean, we've won seven in a row in baseball, and we look to go for eight straight winners today. It's pretty incredible. Uh, we have won literally seven straight baseball selections, including a four-unit selection on the Mariners, who easily won seven to two yesterday. It's not every day that you win seven in a row, and it's our 130th golden week. And we're going to try to go eight in a row today. We've hit as many as 22 in a row in college basketball in the past. So uh, who knows? We gave you the Mariners on Sunday, 7-2 winner. We gave you the Astros on uh, Saturday, 4-0 winner, We gave, uh, which was a 6 unit winner. A 6 unit winner on uh, the April 15th as well. Giants over the Indians or Guardians, 4-1. We gave you a 7 unit winner on April the 14th. The Yankees, 3-0. Uh, April 13th was the under between Baltimore and Milwaukee, 2-4. to four. That was a four-unit winner. And then the Yankees again on April 12th, which was a seven-unit winner, 4-0. Over our last five side selections, we have won 22-3. to <laughs> Over our last five baseball selections, we have won 22-3. to three. That's how good we've been. And 7-0, uh, trying to make it 8-in-a-10-2 row, Ten and two to start the baseball season at plus 37-20. And if we win today, we'll go to 11-2 and two for plus 44-20. So a 7-unit baseball selection at 740 tonight. We hope you're on it. Hockey, we won with the over between the Blues and the Predators. Over 6 on Sunday, 8-3 to three winner. We won 4 in a row in hockey, too. We are plus 9,400 in hockey. I don't know why you're not in the hockey season or the baseball season. We won... Uh, four in a row in hockey, plus 9,400. We hit plus 4,360 last year, and we're not stopping as far as I'm, as far as I know. Uh, hopefully, in the NBA will win our five-unit selection today as well. But uh, four in a row in hockey, seven in a row in baseball. We're going to try to hit both of them today as well. We can't wait for you to join us. Be sure to join us for the WNBA season as well, and also hit us up for our golf, um, which was a great weekend at the RBC Heritage for us. Um, the Zurich Classic is upon us, and um, we have a three-year hockey selection today. So between baseball, NBA, NHL, golf, MMA, and KBO, which is Korean baseball, join us. Your free pick today is, I like the Giants today over the Mets. I think the Giants can upset the Mets, if you will. I think it's a good line. I think it's interesting that the line is not as big as we think it is for a pitcher that has a 0, 0.00 ERA, right? Um, it, this game goes off at 7-10. You're going to get them at plus 105. And, uh, you know, I like the Giants today. Interesting that you see a 7-2 versus a 7-3 team hooking up here. Just odd to see the Mets as a 7-3 team. Happy for them, though. Uh, good for New York and the Mets. The San Fran swept them last year, though, so the Mets do have a little revenge. I get that. So the Mets have some payback. But San Fran is off of throttling Cleveland 8-1, 4-2, and 4-1. The Mets took 2-3 of three from Arizona. Tyler McGillis 2-0 with a 0 ERA. 
But, I mean, he hasn't given up a walk yet this season either, and he's been pretty phenomenal. But San Fran is quite good against elite pitchers. They have an amazing uh, coaching staff. I wouldn't be surprised at all if San Fran does well here. Cobb gets a rare start, and uh, it would be, uh, I think it's so tough to keep balling out every single game, which McGill has done. And I think he gets hit today, and I think the Giants surprise a lot of people, and I think they pick up the win. I like the Giants today over the Mets as your free play. Uh, I also want you to keep an eye on the Jazz and the Mavericks over. I think the first game in which you went way under, I think that's fine. But I think this game probably goes over. Um, by the way, the Giants are also 4-0 versus a team with a winning record. Uh, and they're 39-12 and against right-handed, right-handed pitchers anyway. And the Mets are only 1-4 lately against teams above 600. Uh, as far as uh, that NBA game, I think the Mavericks, obviously with the injury between Luka and Hardaway, that really affects them. And uh, Utah won 99 and 93 last game. But I think the roles are pretty firmed at this point. And I think you're going to have uh, and I think you're gonna have a Mavericks team that really shows up today. I like them as a good dog today. I like them to be an active dog. The Jazz can't shoot 32% from the field from three-point range again. The over is 6-2 and two overall for the Mavs. And I just think that the Mavs show up and score a lot of points. I don't know if they'll cover, uh, but I do like them to score more points. And I lean on the over in that game. Really good YouTube premium selection between the Raptors and the Sixers and the Pirates and the Brewers. We won both YouTube premium thoughts yesterday. The YouTube premium selection was on the Reds and Dodgers over, and then also a lean on the Bucks Bulls under, which also hit. That's what we have for you guys. Hope you guys are doing great. Indian Cowboy, working hard for you every single day. Please take a moment and like and subscribe.